This video explains how you can create new text files on your MacBook Pro or any other Mac system. So for that there is one application called as text edit through which you can create new text files or RTF files. And other way to create text files is by command line. So first I'm gonna tell you about this text edit. As you can see I've already opened the text edit. And uh, by default uh, if when you save this file we can see that the extension is RTF, that is rich text document. And uh, if you want to save this file in a simple plain text, uh, then uh, what you have to do is go to the format and then click on make plain text. Then what will happen is if you try to save this particular file, it will take the text extension. And at the time of saving this file, you can choose the location where you want to save the file. So this is one way to create text files in Mac. Now I'm gonna also tell you how to create a text file using a command line as well. For that go to the terminal or also called as command line and there as you can see uh, previously I've executed one command called as touch t1.txt. So touch is basically a Unix command but you can use it in this Mac terminal as well. And then first of all give the command name that is touch followed by any number of files that you want to create. Let us say t2.txt. Let us create another file t2.txt. Then hit enter, and then that file will be created in your current directory. So my current directory is users slash admin. So I'm just gonna go there, and over here you can see that the t2.txt file is created. Right now this file is empty. You can see that there are zero bytes in this file. Because we haven't written anything into that file if you want to write anything just double click on that file and then that file will be opened in text edit Here you can type anything that you want and once you are done you can save this file and then close it and now you can see that there are 15 bytes that's how you can create text files and uh, RTF files rich text uh, format files Thanks for watching this video.